As you probably know, it can be a huge detriment to be cool in high school. You have to worry about all these friends always bugging you and teachers giving you preferential treatment and everyone always trying to swagger jack your style. Luckily for me, I am really uncool. Loser. See? If you want to be like me, you gotta follow my five easy steps for being uncool. Let's start with step one. So step one is to get a bottom locker, like this one. Because it's so low, you're gonna to want to sit down crisscross applesauce in front of it. It's very important to put all your belongings, including your book bag, like in the middle of the hall so all your peers can trip on it and hate you. And also, you're gonna to wanna to forget your combination like five times in a row, so you're at the locker basically for the entire class change. Step two is simple. All you're gonna to wanna to do is wear long black tube socks with flip flops. You wanna make sure that that toe thong is really pressed up in between your big toe and your second toe, so you can really clearly see the outline of the big toe, you know, and just wear those all day and you'll be great. Step three is a little more tricky. So after every period, you're gonna to wanna to stay after class to ask your teachers how their day was, or try to get points back on a test for an illogical reason. Then, when there's one minute left in class change, you're gonna to wanna to run as fast as you can down the hall, very audibly. I'm gonna be late! Step four, tell everybody about all your problems, especially if they don't care at all. Step five is digital, so it might be kinda of confusing, especially if you're old. Uh, on Twitter, you're going to want to tweet really vague things like, I'm so confused, or why is this happening to me? Or you can even get vaguer than that, like, he is so, or corn cobs? And that's my five tips for being uncool.